Hey guys, welcome or welcome back. Today we are going to be reorganizing the bookshelf. So for this, I don't really have a plan for how I want this to look. I think I'm gonna go by genre. I am gonna be mixing some of my TBR in there cause most of this is my TBR anyway. So they're already mixed in there. But with these ones, I think I'm gonna leave my SJM shelf there and I think I'm gonna leave the Cruel Prince series up here. This one I want to change and I'm thinking about doing my Throne of Glass and putting that here instead. I don't know. And I also think that I'm gonna just leave this top shelf. I'm gonna like clean it up a little bit, but I think for the most part, I'm gonna leave all my sprayed edges facing out and leaving them on the top. So this one probably won't change much. It's mainly gonna be all down here. So let's start taking all of these off and organizing it. Okay, so I'm gonna start with the top shelf since I know that I already just want to put back all of my sprayed edges on the top. So we'll do that one first. Okay, so I think that's how I'm gonna leave that one. This next shelf, I guess I'll take all these down. This next shelf is where I'm kind of struggling because I don't really know what I wanna do with it. I don't know if I kinda wanna do like a, I kinda wanna do like a black and white shelf there. I think that might be what I do. Do I? I think that is what I wanna do. I think I think I'm liking that one I think the next one I'm gonna go a little bit more colorful and put some of my romance books there I think with that one I might want to do I think I might want to do like a little bit of a rainbow shelf there maybe I don't really have I'm noticing that most of my books are black which makes it kind of hard to do rainbow we're gonna figure it out okay I like it better but I'm still iffy on it mm. now for this shelf all the books back there are just like my old books that I can't bring myself to get rid of so they're just gonna stay there 
and we'll pile all my newer books in front of them so I think this one will just kind of be like this where it's like a loosely color coordinated but not fully you know but I do want to keep like the series together in this part so that's why I say like loose loosely color coordinated um, I think I'll put all of my hardcover ones on first Okay, well those are too tall, so do sideways first. I think I might buy a new bookshelf in here since I did slightly re like shape this. I have a little bit more room to where I could move my TPR car over and I could get a little bit longer bookshelf, I think. I think that's what I'm gonna do. Cause this one's just it's like a bookshelf without really being a bookshelf. Well, that's pretty much filled, so I think I'm gonna take some of my actual TBR books out of here. get put back onto the TBR cart which is already like it's already getting so <laughs> unorganized again it's fine these two I don't really know where to put them I definitely need a bigger bookshelf well anyway We have now the Throne of Glass series there with my the rest of my SJM, so Akatar and Crescent City. Then I have the Folk of the Air series by Holly Black up there. I kept up here pretty much the same. I got rid of the Atlas Six and the Atlas Paradox over here. Left those, got my little plant. Then on this shelf, I don't really know what I fully want to do here. I don't like this being here, but I don't really know where else to put it. I think that's what I'm just going to do. Okay, I think that's just how I'm going to leave it with the bookmarks back there. Here is the black and white shelf with the TBR jar and just the little prop dagger. Then we have the rainbow shelf, which I didn't like it when all the books were facing normal, so I did end up stacking the green into blue there. I still don't really know how I feel about it, but for now, it's good. Then finally on the bottom shelf, we have hardcovers into all the other books that I've read recently, except for Nettle and Bone. That one's still on my TBR this month. And then the rest of them went back onto the DBR cart. But that is all that I have for you guys today. I think what I'm gonna end up doing is measuring this out, seeing exactly how wide of a bookshelf I can get and getting a new one that's more meant to actually be a bookshelf. Cause yeah, once I actually do start reading all these, I don't really wanna leave them on the TBR cart when I'm done. Expect that video probably coming soon of putting together a new bookshelf and Re reorganizing my bookshelf. But thank you guys so much for watching today. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to keep up with all my future videos, and I will see you in the next one.